his ACL folding program, which takes the primary sequence of amino acids and figures out the tertiary structure from that. My piece of his puzzle was finding or getting sparse NMR data and using that to perfect that tertiary structure. Um, what I got out of the summer at, with the RU program was a really good research experience. I'm certain now that I want to do research for the next four years after I graduate. <laughs> Hi everyone, uh, my name is Tim Boswell and I've been here in the uh, Vanderbilt RU program in chemical biology. Um, I am from Johnson City, Tennessee, but I go to a small school up in Pennsylvania called Grove City College. Um, so let me tell you a little bit about my research that I've done this summer. Uh, I've been working on the early stages of preparing a method for quantifying a certain metabolite in urine that is being used in cancer treatment studies. So uh, the COX enzyme converts arachidonic acid to the prostaglandins, including prostaglandin E2. Now, COX-2 enzyme is upregulated in a number of cancers, which means that the PGE2 levels are higher in the cancer. PGE2 is metabolized to a, a certain metabolite called PGEM, and that shows up in urine. And so we're working on a method to quantify that because the current method is really slow and efficient. So I've been using uh, MALDI mass spectrometry um, because it can be adapted for a high throughput platform to speed up the process, and it can handle really impure samples. So what, most of what I've been doing is trying to derivatize this PGEM molecule with different derivatizing reagents to provide it with properties to help it ionize in the mass spectrometer and help us quantify. Uh, one of the things I've really learned is that you can't expect everything to work. It's research, you're trying new things. Lots of times it's not going to work because no one's done it before, but you got to keep plugging along and doing your best. Um, I've also learned that I really love being in a collaborative environment. I really like the, the academic environment and how everyone is constantly um, encouraging me and, and teaching me new things and telling me about their research. I've seen a bunch of seminars about many different uh, research areas at Vanderbilt, and I'm just constantly impressed at how much research is going on and how many good things are happening. Uh, so it's been a great experience. I encourage you to check it out. Um, and good luck. characterizing the metal binding sites of calprotecting and teasing out how that affects the growth inhibition of Staph aureus by calprotectin. From this RAU experience this summer, I really gained more of an appreciation of what graduate school life is going to be like and what it's going to be like to work in a lab. You know, eight hours a day and have that be my full time job. I've also gained a lot more tools to use when I'm investigating molecular structures, and I've really gained an appreciation for structural biology and just really varied tools that you can use with that, and all the different techniques we can use to investigate structures and how that affects function, and ultimately how that can be used to help our lives.